Oh, since I did it for... <clears throat> so, since I'm doing it with movies, I might as well do it with games, even though I don't think anybody really watched these videos. Here are the video game collection update for the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox, and finding out the news that the PlayStation has a lifespan in it that will die and won't really even play the games you have with the disc, I probably won't be buying any more PlayStation games, and I'll be switching over to the Switch and that kind of stuff. So, let's just continue what I have. Un the Uncharted Collection. Never played any Uncharted games, but I had the fourth one because it came with it. This was at a Goodwill for a dollar. Figured I might as well try it out. Crash Bandicoot 4, it's about time. I got this as a Christmas gift. That's how long ago I got these things. Uh, I haven't played it yet. Because you know, I have other things to do. It looks fun enough. Like I said, it was a gift. It's a Crash Bandicoot game, so I'll probably like it. And it's one of those uh, side scrollers and that kind of stuff. So, you know. Another one I got. Well, this one I got on Black Friday for like 10 bucks. It's the complete Kingdom Hearts game. I always wanted to play Kingdom Hearts when I was, you know, in middle school when the games were first coming out. But I didn't have a PlayStation 2. So I couldn't play any of them because they were PlayStation exclusives. And you know, for 10, for all of them, why not? Why not give it a try? I'm sure somebody will come along and make some hacked version of a PlayStation 4 where you won't need to have their stupid uh, inner clock thing. Because they're just killing the PS3, a lot of people like the PS3. Scribble knots. This was at five below. It's the scribble knots with DC characters in it. Lego Harry Potter to complete collection. This was another Christmas gift that I got, even though I already own it on the uh, Switch. Someone just gave this to me for a Christmas gift, so now I have that. It's fun enough. Skylanders Racers. Got this from, like, a closing Sam's Club. I just never put in the collection. Disney Infinity 3.0. I got this for Christmas when, this, when Disney Infinity first came out. I just haven't... I just hadn't opened it, so... That's, there you go. Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. I got this or a buy one, get two free sale at Target. Because it was, uh... Jedi Fallen Order. Yeah, it's a long RPG game. I probably won't end, ever finish it. I'll play it, see how much I like playing it. But, you know, the way I play it, it just sits there on a mute TV, so I can't even hear it. And, yeah, I'm probably not going to ever finish it, but I wanted to try it out, and it's a Star Wars game for the Star Wars collection. And they said, buy one, buy one, get two free. Same goes for Star Wars Squadrons. Uh, the PlayStation version comes with a VR, but, you know, probably never play that because I don't own a VR. It's just another Star Wars game. It's a shooting in space style game. For the Xbox One, more Skylander speed. This is from a closing store. Just like the other Skylanders one, they were like under five bucks. I just never bothered opening them. This was from Five Below, Skylink for the Xbox, or Starlink. This is the same thing as the one for the Switch, just without the characters. Another one from Five Below, Jagged Alliance. Just another Five Below game, you know, five bucks. Give it a try. Another Five Below game, Gears 5. The Gears of War game. They were playing any the other ones, but hey, for five bucks, give it a shot. And that's all the games I bought over since December. Or given as a gift. Check your five belows because they always get PS4 and Xbox One games. And currently, it's the Starlinks. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.